out of Bradley. 28 degrees with a notice that wind out of the north northwest at nine. That does make it feel a little bit cooler. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, how lovely are thy branches. You'll notice the camera bouncing around a little bit with a wind out of the north northwest at nine, making that 34 feel a little bit cooler. All right, here are the temperatures uh, 25. That's where we should be. So we're there. It's just you've got this northwesterly breeze out there that's making the temperatures feel a little bit cooler. Here are the sustained winds, anywhere from nine to 14, sevens and eights. Uh, it's not huge. I mean, a 14 mile an hour sustained wind is a little bit huge, but everybody else is just between about three and nine, but it's just enough to make things colder. We've got one gust out there to 18 miles an hour, so it does make it feel like it's 27 in New Haven. Forget the upper 30s, so that's the actual temperature. 13, 15, 19, bundle up weather. This is winter coat weather, and you're going to need to do so during the day today. Kids, you're going to be outside for recess, but it's going to be a chilly day with abundant sunshine. Lots of sunshine, according to First Alert Futurecast, tomorrow's weather today. I just ran the clock down through 5 p.m. We're good. Tonight, we're clear. Tomorrow is another abundantly sunny day, but a big warm-up with the southwesterly flow. That is going to mean a lot of difference here in the state, with temperatures pushing near 50 degrees tomorrow. So this cold little snap that we're enjoying today with temperatures only in the low to mid to upper 30s, it only lasts a day. And then here's your seven day forecast, 52 tomorrow. Wow, 49 on Saturday, partly sunny skies. Sunday, increasing clouds with some rain developing by the evening. And then a first alert for more rain and wind on Monday. Tuesday, morning showers giving way to partial clearing. And then it gets colder again for Wednesday, 39, as we move into the very busy holiday weekend. All right.